December 6th, and it is like 6 o'clock at night, and we just got home, as you can tell. Miller! Bella! Say hi! And it has been a long day. I have such a headache. Miller! Stop that. I have such a headache, and I'm about to eat. We just stopped and went and got Subway on the way home, and... Yeah, so, this is going to be another one of those vlogs, but tomorrow I'm off, and so I'll be able to do like a full vlog for you guys, which I'm excited about, because um, I do enjoy vlogging, but on the days that I work, it's just so hard. Um, so, yeah. Alright, guys, so for today's Vlogmas, I am going to show you guys a Dollar Tree haul. We are having a Christmas party this weekend, so that's really exciting, and, um, yeah, I just thought I would share with you guys, thought I would share with you guys what I got. Of course, I'm in my pajamas and whatnot because I work today, I'm exhausted, and this is real life, so I never really ever wear makeup or do my hair, so, yeah, um, Let's just jump right on into the first bag. This is a lot of like, everything in here is like Christmas related for the most part and then stuff is like stocking stuffers that I got for Dwight or whatever. And he doesn't watch these videos so he's not gonna see it right now. So, the first thing I got was this cute little stocking. Um, and it's probably gonna be one of my Dirty Santa gift idea things. The next thing I got was this photo prop kit um it's an eight piece photo prop kit which i thought was really cute and for a dollar you can't beat that because i know i bought um one for the wedding and it was like 25 dollars for i don't know how many pieces but still so that was a pretty good deal i thought and then i got these cupcake paper things so that i can make cupcakes I got a tablecloth and it's just red and white snowflakes and that's like the main theme of stuff they have so that's what I got. I got this little Santa platter, it's plastic. And then I got two metal little trays or plates or whatever, one's the white snowflakes and this one is just a snowman. And then I got these cups, um, these are mainly for, um, the hot chocolate bar that I'm doing so we have just regular cups for drinks and stuff and then I got these necklaces there's two in each pack so two gold and two green and I just thought these were cute I just got this stuff for people to wear if they wanted to or we're doing kind of like a Christmas outfit contest in a way. So it was like pajamas or onesies or sweaters or whatever. And then we're all going to vote on whose outfit we like the best or who's the most Christmassy or whatever like that. So um, I figure people can add those to them if they want to or if they don't wear anything but want to have something on, they can. And then I also got these little headbands. So this one has Santa on it. These are antlers. I got these with red antlers. I just got one of everything that they had for these. And then the little snowman. So those are super cute. And then also to go with that, I got these two light up necklaces as well. Which are super cute. Everything is super cute. Um, I got three of these and I already have like four or five. Um, so they're the little hot chocolate K-cups. And I decided to do this because last year we went to a gender reveal party. And they had a hot chocolate bar, but they made like a huge pot of it, and not even half of it got drank, and we had to like throw it away because there's no way we can drink that much hot chocolate. So, um, I got these, and I'll just have the Keurig set up and a pitcher of water and sit next to it and everything so that, um, once it goes down, once they get the chocolate, hot chocolate and they need to add more water or whatever, then they can do that easily. And yeah, so four of these for a dollar I thought was a good deal. And then I just got red and green um, silverware. I got a thing of Play-Doh. And then 
I got socks, which you can never go wrong with socks. So I got these two striped pair, gray and black. And then I got a solid gray and a solid red. So love those. And then these are just some things I got to put in Dwight's stocking. Um, so I got him some chapstick. I got him some floss sticks. And then I got him some of the deodorant that he can use. He can only use a certain type of deodorant. So I just got him a couple of those to stock up on. Alright, and in the next bag, these are so huge, but I have two of them. Um, so the first thing I got are these pitchers. Like I said, one to just keep water in to keep filling up the Keurig. And then one to put something else to drink in. And then for napkins, I got a bunch, but I also just like to hoard napkins as well. So I got these that say Merry and Bright. These say Have a Holly Jolly Christmas. And these are beverage ones. And then other beverage ones are these that say Merry and Bright. And then I got two packs of the regular size snowflake napkins. And then a pack of these. And then for plates, um, I got a pack of Santa and then two packs of these snowflakes. And then I have some small, like, clear dessert plates that I'll get out as well. So, yeah. Alright, the next thing I got, which is my favorite thing, and these are going to be gifts for some people. I won't tell you who in case they watch or you're watching. But, yeah. So, I got, they have the cutest cups, like... These are freaking adorable. So I got two of these, and I love these. And they're like hard plastic and sturdy and whatnot. And then I got one of these. And I got three of this one. So, and this one has the Christmas trees on it. Super cute, love these, cannot beat these for a dollar. These are awesome gifts as well. And then I got one of the kids one, which is so cute. And yeah, so that is everything I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, I was trying to think if there's anything else I can show you. I guess I can show you. I got these as well on the same day. Um, this is also, I guess, like an easy gift idea if you're looking for something to get somebody. But for all of our parents and grandparents and stuff like that, we're getting them pictures. Um, so I got these black 5x7 frames. And like I said, a dollar. You can't beat this just for a gift. And, you know, a picture is probably like less than a dollar as well. So it's a really inexpensive but special gift at the same time. And we just had fall pictures done. So I'm going to do those and wedding pictures and stuff like that. Um, but these are my favorite thing that I found. I love this idea. And I was just going to do a 5x7 and an 8.5x10 or 8x10 or whatever. Um, but then I saw these and thought that this was um, so much better and such a, you know, this would be a better idea basically. Um, so it is this frame and it has a 5x7 and then it has two 2.5x3.5s. Two and, and, and so we're just going to put like, um, I'll show you in another vlogmas when I put these together, um, once Christmas is over because I don't want, like I don't mind that they know what they're getting, but I, the pictures that are going in them are what makes it even more special, so I'm not going to tell you, but I will show you guys when I make these. So yeah, and then I just got one of these for everybody, so I'm super excited about that, um, I love giving gifts that are sentimental because people, I mean, we all buy what we want when we want it. So, like, trying to come up with, like, something to get someone is hard. And so, it's really simple and really thoughtful and it's still easy and inexpensive to go this route and do, like, pictures, just something creative. So, super excited about that. And, yeah, so that is everything I got from the Dollar Tree this go-round. Um, I might be going back either tomorrow or Friday, probably Friday, I'll know more of what I need, um, but yeah, so, sorry this wasn't really a vlog, but I hope you guys enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up, 
tomorrow I am off work, so it'll be a normal vlog. And yeah, subscribe if you haven't already. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.